Hello everyone, my name is Holden Hardman. This is my lovely wife, Jen, and today we're watching Toy Story 4. Uh, I am sick, I'm pretty significantly sick. Jen has just begun to get sick, so that's kind of the situation we're in. I normally would have postponed this until we were feeling a little bit better, but with the way our week is, we're either filming it today or no videos for a week, so we wanted to go ahead and just get it done. And I'm, yeah. look, I'm looking to have a good time. We're gonna sit back, it might be a little bit more chill. We're still gonna have fun, but I'm really looking forward to Toy Story 4. I think uh, all the Toy Stories that we've done so far have been great. Watching Toy Story 3 for me was a great rewatch because upon rewatching it on the channel, it was a little bit more um, emotional than I remembered it being for me. And I think it's really great entry into this Toy Story franchise. The ending of Toy Story 3 would have been great to have stopped it there. So continuing on, a lot of people say it's a cash grab and stuff like that. But I have seen a lot of comments saying that they feel that continuing on is still working for them. And I, I have seen Toy Story 4. I only saw it once in theaters. I'll wait to give my overall opinion later. But how are you feeling going into this fourth entry? I'm excited. You know, I feel like Toy Story 3 was kind of a natural ending, I felt like. Andy went off to college and the toys were transferred to um, another child for her to enjoy. So I felt like, yes, they could have ended it there, but I'm also excited about like, where does that leave them? More curious than anything. Yeah. Well, before we get into it, we can't forget the comment of the day. Today's comment of the day comes from when we did Toy Story 3 from Just Some Brian, 6456. This was such an emotional experience watching this movie for the first time. Like many others, I was a kid when I first, when I saw the first two Toy Story movies and was 22 when I saw this one. I felt like I grew up alongside Andy and knowing it's the same actor from the original movies made it hit all the more. Thankfully, I watched it with big 3D glasses that hid my tears. Thank you so much for that comment of the day. But of course, I got another one for you from Matt Cook, 3048, who said, Toy Story 2 is the best Toy Story movie of the four. Takes what was great about the first and delivers one of the best sequels of all time, right up there with Shrek 2. This is a great Toy Story film and ends Andy, Andy's journey with the toys really well, but Toy Story 3 is my, but Toy Story 2 is my number one. I said Toy Story 2 was probably my favorite before, but after doing three and then after we do this one, I might have to re-examine how I feel about which one is really my favorite. Mm -hmm. uh, but thank you guys so much for those comments of the day. If you want your comment featured in a comment of the day, leave us a comment down below. We'll check those out. For now, let's go ahead and get into it. Toy Story 4. Look at this animation. Yeah, that's really good. Oh wow, look, the rain on his shirt. Yeah. The rest of you, stay put. Wow, I think the animation looks even better. Yeah. A significant amount of time has gone by, even between three and four. Mm -hmm. They're lost toy side yard. Billy, go, Gruff. They have names? You never told me that. You never asked. There. Oh no. Operation Pull Toy. Barbies. Looks good. Look at that water sim. Bo peep. Bo peep. Yeah, you can see it's like porcelain. Yeah, reflection. she's like glossy. Yeah. Look at that. See the little beads of water. Yeah, on the slinky. rain looks really great. Even like how it falls and yeah. lamp go to a good home. I don't want it anymore. <gasps> it's okay. What? No, 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 you can't. It's time for the next kid. And thank you again for everything. You know, kids lose their toys every day. Put in the wrong box. Oh. Oh, no. Mom, where's Woody? <gasps> Come inside. I can't. You can't. So that's what happened to Bo Peep. A friendship Wait, will never die. When mom quickly cleans the bedroom like that, expect to be put in the closet. <laughs> Do I need to be worried? No, no, my guys are veterans. They'll hang in there. Good, just keep them calm until we get work. The town is open! Hi, Mayor, Banker, Sheriff. Okay, bye, toys. Sheriff Jesse. Giddy up, bullseye. Toys don't go to school. That's That's the rule. Hey, what are you here? Oh, thanks, Jesse. We're here for you, buddy. I don't want to. Oh. 
Bonnie. Don't forget your backpack. You're gonna have so much fun. Woody? Uh oh. <laughs> Atta boy, Woody. Oh. What a cute animated kid. Bonnie, honey, it'll be okay. <laughs> Today, we're going to make pencil holders. No. <laughs> oh. I love Woody. It's really cutting it close to some of these, though. Yeah. Hello, I'm Forky. Nice to meet you. Well, hello, Forky. It's nice to meet you. Cool. I finished kindergarten! <laughs> no, that, that, that was just... Going on a road trip! Can I bring Forky? Of course you can. Yeah! That pose, easy, huh? That poses an interesting question about creating this <gasps> life. Yeah. <laughs> no. I knew it. already making friends. No, no, she literally made a new friend. <laughs> Come on, there you go. Oh. Uh, good, good. Forky! Golly, Bob half. Trash? <laughs> no, no. Toys. Come on! Ah! <gasps> trash. How does he want to go to the trash? Because he was made from trash. trash. Look, I know she had the biggest smile on her face. I wish you could have seen it. <laughs> oh, no. Shoots and ladders. Where are you, Forky? There you are. <laughs> no, 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 no. Big girl scary. I Bonnie. Woody is doing the most, man. Oh, no. Let's eat some breakfast and hit the road. Jeez. Oh. oh. <laughs> we'll, we'll just be stuck. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Might be time to give up on Forky. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. I'm going to do this every day. <laughs> Trash, here I come. Throw yourself away. Throw yourself away. Remember it being this hard. <laughs> Want me to take the next watch? The little voice inside me would never leave me alone if I gave up. The voice inside of you. Who do you think it is? <laughs> uh, me? So your inner voice advises you. What? It's a secret mission in a charter train. Let's go. Uh oh. Where's Forky? I am not a toy. I'm a spark. Be quiet. <laughs> Freedom! <laughs> oh my gosh. Woody, this is not worth it, dude. Not at all. Forky. Got some cojones. Forky. Oh. Carry me. No. Create happy memories that will last for the rest of her life. Woody is so loyal. I know. You are going to be there for Andy when he Who's Andy? I mean, Bonnie. Carry me. No! <laughs> Andy was my other kid. I was a favorite toy, actually. How much ground he's covering. And then they leave. They go off and do things you'll never see. I find yourself, after all those years, sitting in a closet, feeling... Useless? Yeah. You're just like me. Trash! What is it with you and trash? It's cozy. I guess. And safe! It's gonna be okay. Forky. That's how Bonnie feels when she's with you. Wait a sec. I get it now. I'm Bonnie's trash. Yes. Wait. You must be feeling awful without me, Woody. We gotta get going. She needs me. Yeah. Ugh, this is exhausting. I know. Forky, look. Bonnie's right over there. <gasps> Hurry! No. He misses his sugar plum. His boo boo. Aren't we going to Bonnie? I know, I know. But my friend might be in there. Friend? A friend is like you and me. Trash? Trash. Like, yes. And I'm very worried that she might be. Is that Bo? 
<gasps> oh, it's that doll from Dead Silence. Uh, no, well. Sorry to bother you, but. The ventriloquist so doll, yeah. For my early morning stroll. And look. Oh, I don't like these. We met you. I actually thought he looked like the one from Goosebumps. Oh, uh. Are you two lost? Lost? <laughs> no, no, but we are looking to be in that lamp in the window. Name's Bo Peep? Yes, I know Bo. You do? Well, okay. Vincent. What service? <laughs> what service? <laughs> That's the song from um, The Thank Shining. You your help. I creepy. haven't seen Bo. And look at that. You have a voice box like me. And, and I love you. Wow, you need to fix that. <laughs> Does yours still work? Hey. There's a snake in my boot. I bet it's the same type. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. No. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, those dolls are freaky. You have what I need. I knew it. Stop him, please. Run, Woody, run. Stop him, please. <laughs> yeah, <the G. laughs> Oh. I'm surprised it's rated G, honestly. It's probably be rated yeah. PG. Oh, no. I'd like to join your posse, boys, but. Can I take it to the park? Sure. Um. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Maybe we should have gone with the fork. The spoon is safer. <laughs> the spoon is safer. Forky? Where's Forky? Mm -hmm. No time to explain. Attack! No time to explain. Trying to listen to his inner yeah. voice. The slingshot maneuver is all we've got. Full speed ahead. Thanks, inner voice. <laughs> no. Yeah. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Step right up. Put your money down. Get yourself real buzz light. Uh. Hey. Be right back, Mr. Cowboy. Woody's just getting past her. Oh! Oh! Aww. Wait for me! Come on! Oh. I never thought I'd see you again. Oh. <laughs> Wait, you're, you're a you're lost, lost toy? toy? That's, That's awful! That's great! Huh? Oh. Watch out! Oh. Oh. I told you not to drive so fast. Oh, hey, oh, hey guys! Whoa, oh, oh. Bobby? Gus? Uh, <laughs> Sorry, guys. Girls. Girls, of course. <laughs> Seven fantastic years. Seven? Woody, this is Giggle McDimples. <laughs> Giggle McDimples. Oh, hi, Giggle. Uh, Officer Giggle McDimples. I run Pet Patrol for Minneapolis. Yeah. Hey! Minneapolis. Well. He gave us to Bonnie. Oh, she says. You have a little girl? No way. Yeah, her other toy is trapped in this antique store. And I... We know that store. That's great. That is great. If... We wasted years there just sitting on the shelf. If I were you, I'd cut my losses. Kids lose toys every day. Bonnie will get over it. Bonnie needs him just like Molly needed you. <laughs> Hearing Molly cry each night. Hey, Fox has one of those. Toys. Yeah, he loves that thing. All right, all right. Thank you. <laughs> oh, oh. I don't know about the skunk looking yeah, thing. <laughs> that feels great. Look at that. Thank you, uh, Benson. <laughs> uh, Stupid. <laughs> now. The eye. <laughs> Think you can just show up and take our top prize spot? You're wrong. Uh, key and peel. Don't understand. Get him. Oh, <laughs> Get him. Get him. Ha! <laughs> How you like that, cheetah? Huh? Let's <laughs> to infinity and my foot! Boom! <laughs> in the vacuum of space, they cannot hear you scream! He's getting away, let's go! I'm trying. Come on! Skunk. Skunk! <laughs> For real. Follow me. Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> you know I love that bow's a little more rough around the edges now. Yeah. Heavy foot traffic at the entrance. Easiest way in is the, the roof. roof. How did you end up here? I thought you were given to a new family. Oh, you know how it goes. Who needs a kid's room when you can have all of this? Meteor shower, look out! <laughs> <laughs> I love how it's working, too. Yeah. The whole gang's still together. Well, I'm, I mean, most of us. 
Buzz? Yeah, yeah, Buzz too. I cannot. Buzz! <laughs> my old moving buddy! Oh my gosh! Buddy! <laughs> <laughs> You ruined our lives. Shame on you. <laughs> Who are these guys? Aww. We're gonna get a kid. Make All right, a let's kid. go. Porky's gone. Oh, honey, I'm sorry. They're about to leave. Leave, leave. Oh, how can you do that? We have to stop them. How? We could frame Dad for a crime so he goes to jail. Or go back. <laughs> we looked everywhere, but we need to get going. Uh, are you kidding me? Okay, Daddy's gonna use some words. Literally, you. <laughs> Daddy's gonna use some words. Are you kidding me? Move off. You move off. Quit S3 heads. No, no, no. What? No. All six eyes just lift in the We can handle a cat. No, not this one. Cat looks really good. Is that how we look on the inside? There's so much fluff. So how? Oh, Bonnie? We've got to get Porky now! Woody, don't! Woody just sits in the closet with no playtime? Yeah, he told me himself. He's not even brushing her <laughs> hair. There. Oh my goodness! Yeah. <laughs> you really want to help? Then stay out of my way. I'm getting my sheep back. That's our objective. We have to get that key. Leave that to us. We know exactly what to do. Mm -hmm. Come from. The keys! Oh, oh my gosh! <laughs> the keys. It was the keys. Well, we're not doing that. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Too visible. What about winner, winner, chicken dinner? Yes. The keys. <laughs> uh, plush rush. There you go. Uh, where is this going? Shh, don't interrupt. What the heck? <laughs> Not gonna happen. And <laughs> oh. And you're sure it's Bo Peep who's with him? <laughs> Have you ever played hide and seek? No. I'll teach you, okay? Okay. But the first thing you do. What are we doing? Shh. Just stand there. Hi, Tinny. Oh, nice Boss. to see you, too. Saw your better half at the front of the store. Yeah, you mess with the cat, you get the claws. <laughs> Bo came back. Look who jumped 40 school buses and landed back into my life. Hi, Duke. That's uh, Keanu Reeves. Duke Kaboom, Canada's greatest stuntman. We need your help. <laughs> Gabby Gabby has his toy and my sheep. Billy, Goat, and Gruff, those are my girls. Aww. <laughs> he sounds like a complete idiot. He does. Oh, wait, are you that toy? Nuh uh. Duke. No way. Duke. Pass. Duke. Negative. Duke. Rejected. Oh, I had a kid. Oh, no. Rejean. <laughs> no. It was the happiest boxing day of your life. Are you supposed to be like evil can evil? Yeah. Do. But when Rajan realized I couldn't jump as far as the toy in the commercial, it's a commercial. It's not real. Rajan threw me away. Rajan. <laughs> okay. Forget your commercial. Be the Duke who jumps and crashes. Can you do the jump? Yes, I Canada. How do we get that key? <laughs> Very difficult. Barely made it out alive. How long were you in here? I don't know, a couple years. You've handled this lost toy life better than I could. Oh, Sheriff. You ever think about getting out there, seeing the world? Without a kid? <laughs> this is the only part of the store I ever liked. Let's kaboom. It'll be fine. Duke's the best. Yeah, at crashing. Oh boy. Huh? Rajon. <laughs> I'm sorry, Rajon. No, 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 no. Sorry, Rajon. <laughs> What's new, Pussy Cat? <laughs> <gasps> Woody, how'd you find me? Right, Falcon. Falcon. <laughs> Take the puppy. I'm too cute to die. I just want to talk. Yeah, with my voice box. Yeah. <laughs> My favorite deputy. Oh, jeez. Girls! Drop oh my it. gosh. No. Oh. oh, no. Oh! Oh, <gasps> oh no. What? Wait. <laughs> Rishon. Kitty, kitty. Funny! Oh. Nice. Ah! 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 
Bunny! <gasps> Bunny! No, 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 no! But I saw Bunny. By my count, there were only four dummies. But the and we outnumbered them, so we Nobody is with you. It's over, okay? Nobody wants this. I do. Why? Because... <laughs> He's just <laughs> putting it back in. <laughs> because it's all I have left to do. I don't have anything else. So the rest of us don't count? It's called loyalty. Something a lost toy wouldn't understand. Ooh. Oof. Put salt on that wound. We've got a carnival that leaves in the morning. Come on. You're crazy. <laughs> Woody. I don't leave toys behind, Buzz. Yeah, but Woody, you're actually leaving. Not now. And he left me behind. What now, inner voice? Mission accomplished. What about Woody? We're going home, Space Ranger. <laughs> Go. Time to fly. Exit the get back run <laughs> Woody. I'm not leaving without Forky. What is that? Isn't there a movie about a doll? Is it Annabelle? No, like a red-headed doll. Chucky. Yeah. Did you miss me, Andy? Is that for kids or is it for adults? It's a, no, definitely not for kids. All I want is a chance for just one of those moments. <laughs> the flat tire is... Where is he? <laughs> Bonnie will notice her backpack is missing. You good, Bonnie? Yep. Great. Let's get out of here. Okay, genius. <laughs> How do you turn this off? Open the pod bay door. I don't know. Just me now. Uh, your backpack's in the antique store. Let's go! Oh no, my backpack! Hey, lamb chops. Hmm. Coast lamb down. chops. Oh. Head to the middle. When the carnival leaves tomorrow, we'll hide right there. <laughs> Oh, no way. Just get set. He only cares about himself. No. <laughs> You're wrong. He's always kind of crazy. Royalty just... You gotta love him for it. Whoa, say what now? Get in. Oh. We're going back. We, we just got here. You heard... Oh, no. no. You are my best friend. Let's play all day. Oh, Vincent. All my dreams are coming true because of you. Thank you. Uh, Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Goodbye, Benson. <laughs> Jesus. I couldn't find it. Quick, before she finds it. There's harmony. Forky. Oh. This Forky is just a mess. I'm Gabby Gabby, and I love you. Oh. You can take it home if you want. Meh. <gasps> Gabby! Yo, Funny. Gabby, Gabby. <gasps> Not our problem, Woody. Let's go. Get lost again. Oh. Uh. This is important. Tell Look at his face. Get the RV to the merry-go-round. The spinny ride with lights and, and horses. Oh, you mean a carousel? Yes, yeah. A carousel. <laughs> 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 oh, that's how Hero lies down in oh, bed. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> Please go away. There are plenty of kids out there, and one of them is named Bonnie. If you sit on a shelf the rest of your life, you'll never find out. He's right. I learned that from the best. How do we do that? Oh, we could We're not sending Dad to jail. You're no fun. <laughs> I have an idea. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Carousel in time? Yes, yes we, we Canada. Canada. What? Right. Right turn ahead. Huh. Does the GPS sound funny to you? How'd it sound it funny? Turn right! No, turn, turn right! right. <laughs> no, no way. Decline. No dice. Duke, Duke, Reject you it. Decline. <laughs> and I can do it with my eyes closed. Yes, you what? Three, two, what? one, go! <laughs> 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 You be shocked. Slow down. I can't. Got a visual on the RV heading southbound. Gabby? I think she's lost. Gabby needs to make up her mind. <laughs> Meanwhile. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Gonna send him to jail. <laughs> what if she doesn't like me? Gabby. I don't know if I can do this. Gabby, this is the most noble thing a toy can do. Not, not, not too far. 
Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Are you us too? Or if she just threw her side again. <laughs> <laughs> what an ugly old Another, toy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'll help you. Can you help us? Oh, honey, what's wrong? I couldn't find you. And then I found this doll. <laughs> you did? Oh, oh, yeah! <laughs> yes! Oh, oh, now! <laughs> uh. <laughs> Dad's totally going to <laughs> Oh, funniest line in the whole movie. <laughs> Happy trails. Uh, I'm glad I got to see you again. Goodbye, Mom. She'll be okay. Bonnie will be okay. Gosh. <laughs> so long, Forky. Who's watching the doors? Uh oh. Goodness, the awning. What is going on? This mean wow. He's a lost toy? He's not lost. Not anymore. To infinity and beyond. I did not see that coming. You, Mr. Toads, want to take a wild ride with. Leave it to us, Jeremiah. Oh, cool. <laughs> Leave that to us. We know exactly what to do. Mm -hmm. Last <laughs> ride! <laughs> I like that! The Zeno's face! How am I uh, alive? <laughs> don't know. <laughs> How am I alive? I don't know. All right, just finished watching Toy Story 4. I thought that this one was a really great time, good entry into the Toy Story franchise, but I'd love to know what you thought. You know, this one was, Toy Story 4 was still a good time. However, I really think that Toy Story 3 was like, I think they should have ended it there. I think what I liked about Toy Story 3 was it really felt like all the the toys were equally involved, yeah. you know? This one focused heavily on just Woody and like the Gabby. And I don't know how I feel about Woody staying with Bo. Mm -hmm. Because one of my favorite things about Woody as a character is his loyalty to the children. I think that's what makes that so special. So I don't know how I feel about that ending. I will say the animation was on point with this one. Keanu, I am so glad that they had him because I think that that was a highlight for me in this movie. Rajan. Rajan. <laughs> yeah, I think that that was fantastic. He was so funny. Forky character was really strange. Thought that Forky actually made a great addition. Uh, it was also good to see Bo with like a little bit of an edge now because she had to adapt to the situation that she was in. I thought that was fantastic to kind of see her in that light. We had Buzz in there, but uh, it was definitely like focused on Woody. I think the ending with him not being with Bonnie anymore just was not, I didn't like it. Mm -hmm. I agree with pretty much everything that you said. Story was heavily focused on Woody. I mean, even Buzz 
wasn't that prominent until like maybe like the right. latter half. And then the other characters just sort of made little cameo appearances. Characters like Jesse and Mr. Potato Head and Slinky and all that. I did like the Key and Peele duo, but they're, and they were, that was when Key and Peele were like really, really at their peak in comedy, which is one of the reasons they were in this together. They were really, really funny, especially the whole jumping out, the key, the key thing. I thought, I really liked that. I thought that was really funny. The whole movie, the whole premise it being Woody trying to rescue Forky from Gabby and Gabby kind of being this misunderstood antagonist and not really a villain was fine. Uh, but kind of like you said, Woody's whole character being about loyalty to the kid, to Woody or to Bonnie. I mean, that's literally its entire motivation for this right. movie was because of how important Forky was. And even when all the other characters were like, he's literally just a spork, he's not that important. Mm -hmm. Woody's like, no, Bonnie needs him. So yeah, I thought that the twist there, like Woody moving on or finally growing up himself in a way to be a lost toy, but not really lost. I understand, I guess, what they were kind of trying to go for, but I just don't like that for Woody. I, I like Woody being like an advocate for the children. Woody was one of the most outspoken characters when it came to staying devoted to your kid and how important it is to make them happy by being in their presence and being such a large part of their memories and life. Like him and Bonnie really didn't have any like goodbye or anything like that. It was yeah. just like, that's it. And you know that Bonnie would have been really stressed out Absolutely. and like hurt that Woody was gone. More so than if Forky was gone, for Absolutely. sure. Absolutely. So, and they never like addressed that, but. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. There was like no closure or anything, which really bothers me for Woody's character because I don't feel like that's who he is yeah. at all. Uh, you're right about the the CG looking way cleaner, like them looking like in the real world. There's a part of me that looks back at like Toy Story 1 and there's a- Nostalgia. There's a nostalgic factor. There's like a simple factor to it. Uh, as much yeah. as I like things looking hyper real, I don't know if Toy Story is like needs to, you know? Right. Um, I mean, I like it, it's great, but uh, you know, it doesn't add anything else because Toy Story has always been great even without that. But I'm not complaining, I, I do like it. Duke Boom, I thought it was great. The whole Rajon thing is hilarious. Yeah. Uh, I think emotionally, Toy Story 3 is probably the most emotional movie. Right. We've had experiences like this, of like trying, leaving to rescue toys in Toy Story 2. It does feel overall kind of like, uh, hey, we wanna make another one what should we do? And then this is kind of what they came up with. Well, I think that they're a little bit lost <coughs> on whether they should go with the reality of the situation that toys do kind of go from owner to owner. We all know as kids, we had a favorite toy that we really, I mean, we have a 15 year old who still has her little ducky that she had when yeah. she was born. So there are those situations where toys stay with their owners throughout their childhood. And I think personally, they should have gone with that because I don't like it going from Andy to Bonnie to now what? He's Woody's just so, solo. Yeah, I think that the true charm of Toy Story is when he is with his kid, yeah, you know, a kid. How do you think Andy's gonna feel when he finds out that Bonnie lost Woody, you know? Right, right. It's like childhood, yeah. but. Yeah, I think they dropped the ball on um, kind of going down that route and in the manner in which it was done. I think if they were gonna do that, they should have handled it much better. Yeah, and I, I understand from the filmmaker's perspective, there's only so many ways that you can go after Toy Story 3, where it re that really felt like an ending. You know, I guess this is kind of the best scenario that they could do. They are doing Toy Story 5, which was announced, so I don't know if that's gonna follow Woody, or if it's gonna follow like Jesse and the others, or combine them again, I don't know what they're gonna do. Mm -hmm. uh, but not horrible at all. I, I don't, a lot of this is nitpicking things and just not liking the direction that they took but that's totally subjective and I understand that. Uh, what would you rate this one? This is a lower one for me, to is be it really? honest. It is. The Toy Story movies have been pretty consistent for me. The storylines in all three of the Toy Story movies, I think were pretty seamless. I think they felt pretty natural. This one just felt a little bit forced for me. I think I'm gonna go with a seven because I still got to see like our familiar characters, but I didn't get enough of that like unity that was present in the first three. The separation was very palpable. Yeah. So 
I'm gonna go with the seven. Yeah, I don't think that this one had any like one thing it excelled at beyond the others. Plot wasn't particularly like super duper gripping. The emotionality was good, I guess, with Gabby first being rejected and then being accepted by the other girl, but didn't top, you know, Toy Story 3 or even really Toy Story 2, in my opinion, with the whole Jesse and Bullseye and the, the prospector and that whole thing. So it just seemed like they were kind of all over the place. And then I really just didn't like the direction they went at the end. And that's just my opinion. I will say that I wish Kaboom had been in the other Toy Story movies because yeah, he, was, he was fantastic, so funny. Truly, truly enjoyed him. Yeah. And then I love that Bo had a little bit of, a, um, of an edge. Yeah. Of an edge. Yeah, I agree that I, I wish that there was more of a, like the group together, either Woody and Buzz more working together mm -hmm. or Jesse and Woody or Jesse, Woody and Buzz, like a trio doing right. stuff. For me, I'd rate this one probably a 7.5. I want to be clear here. I did really enjoy it. I thought that the comedy was really great. I just, I don't think it was as funny as some of the others, as emotional as some of the others, or anything that really makes it stand out truly above the others. So yeah. 7.5 for me. But of course, these are just some of our thoughts. We'd love to know what you guys think down in the comments below. So leave us a comment down below. We'll check those out. If you like this video, leave it a like. It helps the channel out a lot. Subscribe, you'll be notified when we post the next video. Check out Patreon. You can watch the full length reaction with us over there. You'll just need your own copy of Toy Story 4 to do so. There's a lot of other great stuff over there too. Some exclusive videos, exclusive content. Check that out. But for now, that is it. Jen and I appreciate you watching. We'll catch you in the next video, everyone. Take care.